Hello guys, uh, welcome back to my channel, this said Prince. So in the previous lecture, we discussed about what are the different locators supported by Winamp driver and how to interact with them. So in case you want to look at the different locators supported by Winamp driver, I'll be putting that into I icon uh, on the top. So you can go visit on that. Also, I'll be putting that into description. So now we are going to discuss about how to select the drop down in Winamp driver. Okay. So now I'm going to the place. I'm opening the notepad. If you will observe, I'm going to settings, then I'm expanding font. And here I have this drop down values, right? So I'm going to select drop down values. So first of all, let me show you how to get element of it. So first of all, it is a bit different here, bit tricky, I can say. I'm collapsing it and then after I'm expanding it, if I go here, for example, first of all, I'll get combo box, right? Then after, if I click on this, I'll get list of elements, right? If you observe regular, this is list items. This is again list item. And as I already discussed, when you see list item, you don't need to use it exactly. You can copy from here the same content list without space item similar way i have used now i'm going to the code file so if you look at it first of all i'm clicking on settings i'm closing this window first i'm clicking on settings i'm opening the notepad first then i'm clicking on settings later on i'm clicking on font section then after i'm clicking on the style drop down uh, through the code after that i'm giving some time 5000 and then i'm trying to do what i am trying to find out the list of items available under that font style combo box so this is how i found the x bar so when i say contains at the rate name comma this uh, two columns uh, two apostrophe i mean then it means that we are going to look for elements which have some value those list values which has some values and now we have got this list of values then what i want is i want to select bold okay so what i'm doing is i'm traversing this list i got the values into the list then i'm comparing with whatever value i want to select with if it matches then i'm clicking on that element so let us look at the flow from the automation so you will see uh, notepad application will open then it will be maximized click on settings then it will click on font now it clicked on this drop down and now the bolt should be selected okay so this is how the drop down can be selected in winamp driver so in the next lecture we are going to discuss about how to select the value in the drop down using actions class that is it for now thank you